guys welcome back to my channel my name is Stefan Ash and today I'm gonna go over the new healer that was announced in Final Fantasy 14 online I'm really excited about a new healer sage that's going to be added to the mix but also kind of concerned about the changes that they might make to the existing healers to balance everything out before I jump into this video make sure to subscribe down below and without further ado let's get into the video to quickly review the White Mage in the Scholar job, the White Mage has a lot of raw potency healing, regens, and their job specific skills are related to lilies, which you gain every 30 seconds. You use a lily for essentially free healing skills, which then you activate the Blood Lily, a massive damage nuke for White Mage. Scholars have less healing potency, they utilize shields, and their job specific skills are the Fairy. Scholars use fairy abilities for shields, healing over time, and the Seraph, which is an awesome transformation for your fairy with some unique support skills. I am very interested to see the type of overhaul they do on Astrologian. As of now, you simply turn on the regen or shield and the skills simply change to what you have active. My thoughts is that they might just get rid of the shield aspect and keep the regen. My hope is they rework the skills to bring the new variety to Astrologians rather than keep the exact same thing they already have. Now let's talk about the new healer, Sage, that will be coming out. My initial thoughts were excitement when I heard the word Sage and thought that this is a recurring job that you see in Final Fantasy series. I thought for sure they're going to go Druid style Sage with a more nature background, but upon watching the showcase, it looks like they went a little bit more futuristic with the new weapons called New Liths. And yes, I have a lisp, so it's a little hard for me to say that word. The only bummer is that I feel like the gun sound associated with Newlith is a little close to machinist for me, which doesn't really excite me about the job. Looking over the screenshots from the showcase, Sage will not require any class to unlock it, which will make it accessible right when released. I'm main with the Viera, so the fact that they used her as the initial picture release is so cool and really makes me excited to see the story behind the new job. In the second screenshot, they show that it heals and protects the party with barriers, which we kind of already assumed since they announced that it was going to be two peer healers and two shield healers. The more interesting sentence that it will be able to temporarily augment their own magic abilities. Astrologian has job specific skills for augmenting the party's attack potency so I wonder how these are going to play out for Sage since they specifically state that they're going to augment their own magic abilities. It's really quite exciting to see how they're going to play into the story and what they're going to offer. I am really looking forward to seeing the skills that the Sage will have as I love playing healers through most of the content that is released along with Black Mage. I'm hoping they introduce a variety of skills that are unique to Sage and they don't recycle the things we are already seeing with the other three healers. All in all, I'm very excited to see Sage come out in 6.0 as well as the unannounced DPS class that they have lined up to be announced in a few months. Leave a comment down below on your thoughts of the new healing class and your prediction for the new DPS class. So the only thing I'm a little bummed about is that the new healing class was not chemist. This was one of the jobs that was being circulated around since in the Crystarium there is a chemist played into the story. That would have been really awesome or alchemist I guess you could say from Final Fantasy X they had an alchemist. Um, and would have been really cool, but I know that they actually have to put in something for future content instead of putting something in old content. Well, either way, I'm really looking forward to seeing Healer in 6.0, and I hope you guys are too. And leave a comment down below what your favorite Healer is to play right now, and if you think there's going to be any changes coming to the Healers. I hope you all have a great day, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!